you're filming me. I couldn't tell. Oh. How can you Hello. not? You have to like. You're in everything. You're even in here. How are you here. doing? You're all right. I'm good. I mean, wait, what? <laughs> are you talking to me or that? That, yeah. Oh. Um, we're going for lunch slash dinner. Lunch or dinner? I'll say lunch because we're going to get hungry again later on a takeaway probably. <laughs> fat life. Hashtag fat, fat life. life. Um, Third life. I like getting takeaways at yours because my mum never, never lets me get them a lot. <laughs> what? Why do you use your mum's permission to get a takeaway? Because it's like... Mum, can I order a takeaway? I'm paying for it and I'm not eating it. No, you can't, Ellie. She's like, no, you had one like three, four days ago. Mm. Why do you need a permission? Mm? Because I feel judged if I say I'm going to do it anyway. I'm like... So you can run the back door because you're really in the back. Anyway, where are we going? Hungry Horse? Yeah. Hungry Horse. It's amazing. I'll show you my food once I get there. I don't have one of those. <laughs> oh my God, I missed that. Did you feel it? Damn it. No. <laughs> He like walked into a leaf, but you didn't care. You were like, <laughs> do it again on the stinging nails. No, I was joking. Oh my God. Tell me to do things. If I do anything for you, even if it hurts me. Roll into that. No, that was a joke as well. Stop. Very nearly just stepped into that. So pretty here. <laughs> I don't get to walk in places like this very often. I should build a river. Should I push you in a river? Oh. How nice it is. Bum, bum, Just wanted to share the experience. Ah! Let's go home and watch like a two hour long video film which you're punching people. Let's, let's not. <laughs> train! Chugga 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 chugga. I like train. We made it to Paris. Look. Let's take one of our... Bonjour! Bon take appétit! A, let's take Hold a on. tourist photo. You marry me? What? <laughs> I'm not going to tell. Don't actually marry me. I don't want to marry you. Yeah. Little joke, we're not in Paris. We're in Oxford. The good old fields of Oxfordshire. Oxfordshire. Oxford shit. Oxford shit on the face. Huge. The plate. It's <laughs> massive. Look. I can actually see the end. Mmm, yummy. Oh my god. Look. <laughs> Delicious. Hi Poops, so today I'm going to Beautycon, I was invited by them to come as a guest and so I'm really excited to meet some other YouTubers and to meet some of you guys. I don't actually know how many of you are going but I don't think there's many. I'll soon find out and let you guys know. Um, so I'm just on the train now on the way to Clapham Junction. I've come from Oxford so I will see Kyle later on. So at the moment I'm listening to a podcast. Shane and Friends, I don't know if any of you listen to Shane Dawson's podcast but it's really funny and relaxing and it helps time go by so much quicker. I also love Ear Biscuits. Ear Biscuits is Brett and Link's podcast. Anyway, I don't know why I'm telling you that but um, the train is so busy that it's not awkward to vlog on because everyone's just so interested in talking to one another. <laughs> That's what is happening today so I thought I'd join you with me and um, I'm going to meet Jana from Jana Vlogs channel. I'm gonna go meet her, her at the station because she knows what she's doing whereas I'm just like what? Help me. Guide me to the light. That is Beautycon. I'm gonna feel, I might feel kind of out of place today because like there's gonna be make, uh, makeup gurus and that and I'm not a makeup guru. I'm just someone who likes makeup and gets asked how to do makeup so I do it really badly. But yeah, uh, it should be fun. So I hope you enjoy the journey. I made it! Hi! Oh, I mean, I'm on my own. Not really. Hi. Um, if I didn't find her, I wouldn't have known where I was going because I was going, going in the wrong direction. To be fair, it took us like 10 minutes to find this place. So. Yeah, because it looks really like creepy. I wouldn't have thought it was here. But yeah, let's go. 
Oh, we're talented, Jenna. We're so talented. We got our wristband. Yeah. Are you following our Instagram? Yeah. yeah. What? <laughs> Where are we? Where are we going? I don't know. Why does it have so much money? Oh, thank you. <laughs> we're like not we ready for this. No We <laughs> <laughs> must film everything. <laughs> what is this cute? I don't know. What are you wearing? Makeover folks. <laughs> <laughs> Then she went home. <laughs> I just snorted. Let me just settle down and talk to you directly about some situations. Basically, it was a beauty event, obviously, and all the people there were vloggers who do beauty, who spe specialize in beauty and fashion and makeup and clothes and hauls and yeah. And you guys know that I do things like that. But I'm quite different in that way. I mean, I am struggling really hard with trying to find a specific route to go down on my channel because I'm just all over the place and everyone knows that. But they're all very specific in their ways that they want to be. Like their, their inspirations are like Zoella, Tanya Burr. So I was aware that it was going to be like that, but as soon as I got there, I was kind of like, I knew this was going to happen. I knew that I'd be surrounded in the types of people that I didn't want to be associated with at school, to be honest. I'm not going to lie. I didn't used to like those types of people at school because they just hate me. I hate them. We're all hating each other. So yeah, it did kind of feel like a blast from the past. Because we got invited, we went. And if we really wanted to go, we would have paid for it and stuff. Because it was uh, like something that we really liked. But it just wasn't me, so I kind of wanted to leave. I could have vlogged a bit more, but I felt so out of place. Um, I did get, I did have like a meeting thing with somebody who was really nice actually. Sometimes when you go to things like this, or when people know you're in the area, they want to like chat about ideas and uh, companies and businesses and just people that want to, I don't know, pitch something to you maybe. Um, and I was also speaking to them about it. I just feel like everyone was kind of like a clone. They all looked like each other. And I get why people like doing makeup and I get why people like fashion trends and looking cool and starting new trends and fitting in with everybody. I get that because it's what you do. Like everyone has a different kind of interest or otherwise the world would be boring. And so, and most people see makeup as an art form. I mean, your face is a blank canvas essentially. And you make it, you make it yours by doing whatever you do. But in my own personal opinion, I see a lot more to life than expensive contour and expensive mascara, eyeliner, blusher, bronzer, foundation, powder, makeup brushes, eyelash curlers. <laughs> and yeah, I include them sort of things on my channel because they interest me, but I wouldn't revolve my life around it. So it's still, it was still interesting to go today. But it just the next station is Walton on Thames. Please mind the gap between the train and the platform edge. Thanks, babe. Um, but I still like find it interesting. I like I'm the type of person that likes looking into other people's kind of lifestyles and stuff. So that was interesting. Um, and I could just you know completely remove this vlog and pretend it never happened. But it's an extra video for you guys, so you might like it and. It's better than nothing, I guess. So now I'm literally just going back to Oxford to see Kyle. If any of you don't know, he lives in Oxford and I live in Brighton. Do you like my owl necklace? That's as fashionable as I'm getting. Like, there was everyone there wearing all this new, funky, fresh fashion stuff that probably cost a million pounds. And there was me, like, yeah, this is Walton on Thames. This train is for Basingstoke, the next. Yeah, there's me rocking my 
eBay necklace and Primark jeans and Store 21 boots and eBay jacket, Primark top. And I've been meaning to talk about this for a while actually. Whilst we're on the topic of people's different channel like specifics and niches and stuff, what would you say that my specific route is? Because I've been wanting to ask you lot this for ages, purely because I don't really know myself. Look how fashionable she is, dude. She's like, yeah. Not about that life, not about that life. This video is coming across as quite judgmental, but I'm not, I'm really not. Like, I'm just the type of person who likes analyzing people's behaviors and not because I'm bitching or like judging, but because it's just interesting to me. Like if somebody walked around with a bin liner on their head, I'd be like, okay, interesting. Let me, let me learn a bit more about that. <laughs> what do you come to my, channel for what is it that interests you when you think of me like think of me what? Yes, please. thank you take it please just marching through the carriages like i own this shit so think of me ellie what comes to your mind what is it that you think my channel represents the most see i want to go down the like advice and help videos because i feel like they are more me and i feel like youtube can sometimes be a big waste of your time if you follow the crowd and do what everyone else is doing but i would like my channel to be a bit more than that i don't want it just to be like clothes makeup things that don't really matter i like i prefer things that you benefit from inside which sounds so cringy but that's what i like most about how my channel works not being big-headed but just just generally also if, uh, there was a few of the you next that station is Waybridge. change here for adelston chertsey virginia water egham and Staines. please mind the gap between the train and the platform edge there was a few of you that said hello so if you took a photo of me thank you so much for saying hi because i honestly did feel so out of place i'm sorry if i look disgusting these are like my traveling clothes and everyone else was like wearing dresses and skirts and i was just like do I look pretty? So thanks for taking pictures, and if you did, make sure you send me them on Twitter. Uh, so yeah, that's just my little chat about being real on YouTube. I think that's why I like people like Graveyard Girl, Helen Melon Lady, uh, well, Helen Anderson now, and still do what they like and enjoy, like makeup and hair, and but they go beyond that. They, they care about other things as well. I feel like a lot of the time you watch people and you you know what they're like in real life and you're kind of like you're not really like that you should probably just lower the tone a bit and just be true be true to who you are anyway i'm gonna stop talking on this carriage now because i probably look like a loon hope you enjoyed what you saw anyway <laughs> if you did if you did give it a thumbs up i know it's a bit shit but and subscribe to my channel to be notified every time I make a new video. I love you guys so, so much. I'll see you guys in three days time. And don't forget to join me on my social networking sites, which are down there and on Cleavage in the description box below. Bye. That was a big mouthful. <laughs> I can never get this bit right. It's this camera. My vlogging camera is